Oh, Auntie Geeky's that absolutely was a gorgeous story. That Mickey's granddaughter story. I'm I've got tears in my eyes again. <coughs> um, really, I'm I'm crying on this. I mean, crying, letting tears fall down my face, because that is a, an absolutely gorgeous story. The fact that that. Uh, woman was able to, to like scrape out of the car and, and as, as far as I understand climb up uh, the boulders and get away from the car even and then to be handed the cup of coffee with the mickey written on the cup uh, this is a cold the snuffle is a cold tears were real <sighs> yeah I, I'm getting quite um, I'm very emotional at the moment I mean I've just come back from Christmas from family from connection um, and also from non-connection I can't mention which mem member of the family that I you know had issues with because uh, you know this you know, I, I have given off a lot of information with total trust in this YouTube community which I still have by the way I think we're an excellent community that the, the more the merrier the, like nearly everybody that comes in to my channel and then when I go to their channel I see that they're friends with this other person we're actually a great community here on YouTube and thank you YouTube for the the, the, the opportunities of a lifetime I mean it's absolutely anybody who's roughly my age and older knows that we didn't we couldn't have ever dreamed of having technology such as this one when we were younger, you know? So it's amazing, it's absolutely amazing. Um, it's nice to have a good feeling before New Year's comes up um, because, uh, you know, it's uh, I don't think of, of... Every day for me is special. Every day for me uh, is, is regarded as uh, my last day. You know, um, I really do live that way. Um, and of course though I would plan for the future and I would think of the past so I'm not one of these people who just lives for the day and that's it, no but I do have the, the idea that each day live it like it's going to be my last day um, <clears throat> and um, well I just think it's so important to, to connect with us and I just want to thank all the people of course I won't mention your names um, I, I thank all the people that do care about each person that they are friends with or know on YouTube regardless if you don't like them uh, the fact that you care enough not to hurt their feelings you know you, you tread softly around the areas of these people including myself I'm definitely one of the people that people have to kind of slightly go easy with how you're gonna say something because I am sensitive you know but that's a good thing and especially it's a great thing if other people realize that know that and do their best you know to say their piece say their point um, but try and get it across in a certain way um, or trying different ways so that's what I'm doing with with the uh, I'm gonna mention him now I mean because I, I, I don't want to ignore him and, 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 I, and, I, and I can handle this it's it. I can really handle this. Do you know why I can? Because I am handling it. <laughs> you know. So so Graham, to you, okay. You yesterday or whenever I did it, I've been flagging a couple of your videos because uh, of the title. If you title the video better, as in don't have my name in it, saying that I'm gay, for instance. I mean, listen, I am gay. I'm lesbian. That's that's, that's you know, every video I do, man. So yes, I am gay. I don't have a problem with that one. I didn't flag that one. You can say Coleman is gay, no problem. Uh, but, <clears throat> um, oh, but on the gay point, the only penis that I've ever sucked was in virtual reality, and uh, virtual uh, sucking, and that was uh, that was yours. You know, that was your penis that I when I joked that you're my friend. And now you've just done a brilliant video, which I gave five stars, by the way. People, everybody else, turn off. Because I'm going to relate with Rogue One Kiwi so that that hopefully by next year, because it's not going to take weeks, by next year, Rogue One Kiwi, Graham Tucker, will actually feel better in himself. He will 
drop eventually, not in a year, it might take five years, this one. He will eventually drop his his paranoia, his 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 disgust at the world, his hatred, um, you know, for different people. I, I don't have a list here, I should make a list, a more precise list. But I'm absolutely, like like my statements always say, I always say, peace be with you always. And I honestly, truly mean that for you, Graham. Peace be with you always. I, I, I hope that on you. I wish that for you. Also, we are all one, but we're not the same. Okay? So, we all do have freedom of expression. Absolutely. You will find, though, and I'll tell you why this is. You'll, you'll find that in the future you'll realize how awfully wrong you were. But that's okay. I don't mind you being wrong, getting me wrong, and getting me right. When you get me right, yes, you're helping me. You know, when you, when you say things that are completely correct about me, you're helping me have to be responsible for the fact that I am that way. And then I decide myself whether or not I'm going to change that behavior or not. And most of the time, if somebody points out a bad negative point about me, I will definitely look at it and I'll more than likely say to myself, I don't want people to think that of me. So I'm going to change that or try and change that. Some things we can't change. Some things we are just, that's just the way we are. Um, but to make an effort... To, to be a bit more compromising and also to make an effort to be obviously nicer in your in, in ourselves is, is is not a bad thing to do um, but uh, so I waffled now lost the point but listen um, I wish everybody out there because tomorrow is New Year's Eve and so today is 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 the second last day of 2008 and it's really a time to celebrate. Um, uh, it, it, you know, regardless of New Year's Eve, oh, the biggest night of the year. It's not the biggest night of the year, uh, really, because every day and every night is the biggest night of of every year. But it's nice to have, just like Christmas. I I wouldn't go to church and stuff like that. And maybe you shouldn't have mentioned that now. All the Christians will turn off this. Okay, but um. You know, at Christmas time, it's a it is a good opportunity. It's a good date. It's a good time of year. It's a, it, the, 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 you know, generally the weather, except if you're in Australia, generally the weather is a good time of kind of like eeriness and possibilities for interaction, integration of people that generally don't get on with each other all the time. Family, <laughs> and uh, it's a good time of the year to force, yes force uh, people to come together and try and, and go like this, you know, uh, because um, if that isn't in sync, then maybe it's now, okay, and, uh, you know, it, it, it's, it's a good time at New Year's Eve, regardless if you say, ah, it doesn't matter about, you know, New Year's Eve, or that's just a stupid, overrated, money-spending day or night. I'd recommend to everybody out there, don't spend a dime, don't spend a penny, don't spend a cent, don't spend a yen. <laughs> um, you know, um, I would use these times to, to self-reflect, you know, to look at yourself and, and this is to everybody now, I've, I've done my piece with Graham, so Graham, this is not on you, because I think you need to be told that. Oh yeah, one thing I want to say is that I've often um, read things, like say for a comment, I've read a comment and thought, huh, huh, what, what? And then a few days or a few weeks later I read the same comment and I realise, oh, it wasn't as bad as I thought it was. <clears throat> I think that's an XXY trait. I'm quite convinced that's an XXY trait, that we don't see everything as it is, um, because our brains don't work that way, in general. So. That's what I'd like to say. I, th I think that, you know, um, that many, many uh, XXYs realize uh, now, probably, that um, peace and party is not um, a a the angry person they always thought he was. You know, uh, 
certainly I am an angry person, but I'm not the angry person that they thought I was. So, just to be clear, I hope that is clear. Uh, I hope also that everybody has a great New Year's Eve tomorrow and truly looks at themselves and thinks, right, was 2008 uh, uh, better... F no, I suppose the best question to ask is, you know, what can I thank 2008 for? You know, what did I do in 2008 that, that I surprised myself on? And I suppose I'll have to think of that, won't I now? And practice what I preach and, and actually maybe make a video and make, make some notes first and then make a video on it maybe. But I don't know if I'm going to get around to doing that. Fair play to all of you people out there who are able to do editing videos, edited videos. Um, fair play to you. And I'll talk to you tomorrow, I'm sure. Or later. Ciao.